Hi everyone! Welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Leela Budgets. My name is Kalila. I am a mom of a one-year-old boy and a wife for the last four years. On my own time, outside of my IT career, I love to cash stuff, budget, and spend time with family and friends. And so if you want to join me on my financial journey on being debt-free and having financial freedom, click like and subscribe and keep on watching. All right, so first off, I want to thank you all for hitting 300 subscribers. I just hit that um, a couple days ago, I think one or two days ago. So thank you so much. The amount of support that I've been getting from this cash stuffing community has been amazing and awesome. So thank you so much. Drop down some ideas below for a giveaway once I hit 500 subscribers. So if you have not subscribed, subscribe and we'll uh, do a giveaway when we hit uh, 500. Let's get going to my coins. I have not done a cash stuffing for a while now. So trying to get used to it again. It's been 10 days, but for me, if I don't do it every day, then it's hard to remember. Um, but I keep this, for anyone that's new, I keep this jar for any coins that I get. And at the end of the year, I will um, see how much coins I got um, from saving. And yeah, this will go probably towards debt, honestly. Or maybe I'll treat myself to a massage or something. These are really nice though. All right, so we'll be working with $423, and like I said, we'll be doing 160 and 100. So we'll be cash stuffing $683, but $260 will be in prop bills. All right, so just want to say, start off and say happy early Father's Day weekend. Um, happy early Father's Day to your husbands, your partners, your sons, um, anyone who is a dad figure or a father figure um, in your lives. And so if you're watching on Father's Day, happy Father's Day. Um, and if you're watching earlier, happy early Father's Day. All right, so going in with gas. This is my personal wallet that I carry everywhere I go. I have $10 left over from gas. So put this on the side for my challenge. I only do one challenge right now because I am trying to pay off all of my debt and I'm very close. And so, you know, it's, you know, I, I just can't spend my time on too many challenges. But I am so excited to start on challenges once after I get rid of my debt, hopefully, um, after this year. So gas will be getting 60. And um, so I only get paid two times a month. And so what I am currently going to be doing now is splitting my check in uh, to two. So doing a cash stuffing every week now instead. So I will be stuffing my cash envelopes, my personal binder and family binder this week or right now. And then I will be doing my sinking funds long term and short term ones next week. Um, groceries will be getting skipped because my husband buys those. Household will be getting 20. I need some Airwick fresheners or the refills. Need that for my bathroom, so. There's that. Um, kids will be getting 70. Uh, my son is one, so I still need to buy diapers and wipes and whatever else he needs. Um, he just got over a cold, and unfortunately, he gave it to me, so I just got over a cold. Also, 
Personal will be getting 15. If you can hear him, he's downstairs coughing. <laughs> I think we got over it, but I think it's just like lingering symptoms. Pets will, getting, will be getting 70. I wasn't going to stuff this, but he still has a little bit of food left. I usually leave it in my checking account, but I don't need food for probably another week. So instead of leaving it in my account to for me to accidentally spend it, I'd rather just take it out and put it in here. Um, miscellaneous, there is, I think, $2 left here. We'll be putting $3 in here. So now there is 5 I always leave 5 in miscellaneous in case I am over budget with anything. That is it for my personal wallet. Next up, we'll be doing my personal binder. So Kalila will be getting skipped. Self-care will be getting 10. Self-care now has 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Beauty will also be getting 10. Now I've been doing so good. I haven't been spending these two categories. So now it has 20. I will need some makeup products pretty soon. So I have to fill this up. Shopping will be getting 10. And fun will also be getting 10. I just, um, so when, when I have tens, you can tell I went into the bank. <laughs> when I have a bunch of fives, it's through the ATM because, um, the ATM just doesn't give out tens for some reason. Um, dining out will be getting skipped. I will, I will stuff that next week. Entertainment will be getting ten. I will be going to an arcade um, place for my sister's birthday, and so I only use this stuffed up, but I also can use birthday money, so totally fine there. HCA will be skipped, and emergency fund will be getting the 100 prop bill. And so now it has 1,100. I do put whatever I got. I get um, interest-wise from my high-yield high savings account um, into emergency fund. And so it is way more than that, but that is what I'm going to share. <laughs> All right, so next up is my family binder. And for my family binder, I'm only stuffing some also. Um, all right, so Kai's I am skipping. Coda, he will be getting $160. Um, I love that in my checking, so I will only put 100 prop bill in here. I'm just going to have to know there's 160, but he needs his allergy shot, so that's around 130, 140, so leave it in checking. Um, Andy, Andy will be getting nothing. Parents. Father's Day coming up, spending a lot of money there. Um, parents will be getting 20. And now parents has 100, 140, 145, and I have an extra 25 in my high yield. So that is 165 that I have in parents. Um, we'll be grilling for Father's Day. Both my husband and um, me, our parents are separated. So we do have two sets of parents on both sides. So I will have a lot to do for this. Um, I'm busy this whole weekend and probably next weekend too. Um, date night will be getting 10. And my, um, for my husband, I don't know what he really wants, but I'll probably just celebrate, um, by taking him out to eat sushi. His favorite thing to eat is sushi, so probably we'll just do that. Um, I have 13 here in date night. 
I usually leave date night. My husband and I like to go either eat out or we like to go watch movies together. Family will be getting 10. This is anything around um, like going to the zoo, taking my son somewhere, going to the park. I don't know. If, you don't need to pay for the park, but just anything that we need to pay for. Um, and then birthday will be getting 50, 20, 40, and 50. My sister's 21st birthday is coming up, and so, um, we'll be celebrating that. And then gifts will be getting 40. And my best friend's birthday is also coming up, and so we'll also have to save up for that. Um, why do I have $5 left over? <laughs> I have no... Oh, I was supposed to put $5 in HCA, you guys. I have a little helping, a uh, little post-it note of things that I have to stuff, or envelopes I have to stuff, and I totally missed this HCA one. HCA stands for Among Clothes Addict. Um, I have to have a envelope for this because I can't keep up with the life. <laughs> I have 60 and that probably can only buy a very simple outfit. Um, but I am saving up for a handmade outfit. So hopefully by end of the year, I can get one. All right. And then let's go on to my challenges. I don't I remember if it's in here or not. No, it's not. I think it's in my short term. Let's go in here. Or is it long term? No, this is my long term. So it's in my long term binder. So I decided to use my one and only challenges. Um, challenge. What is it? What is this called? I don't know. A challenge. This is the only one I have. I got it from Budget with Lena when I got um, her binders. This was a freebie, so I started using this. It pretty much is just um, $200 um, you get to save, and you can just mark off whatever dollar bill you get. So I'm going to put in this 10, and we'll mark off this 10 here. And when we get to 200, then I will be putting this to debt. So this is any leftover money I have from my personal wallet. So now we have, I think, $40 in here. And that is it. If you made it this far, um, thank you so much. Um, hmm. If you made it this far, put a pink one emoji down below so I know that you got till the end. Um, as always, I appreciate you guys so much. Um, thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.